how are you guys doing today? And welcome to Resident Evil Village. Before we get started, Starlit, sorry. <laughs> Before we get started, today is my 23rd birthday. It's so crazy how this game all of a sudden <laughs> releases on my birthday. That's just insane. And I'm so glad I'm playing it today. I've been waiting for this for like too long. So yeah, we're gonna get to that point. So, there's some movies, so we're gonna check those out. I think it's a playback of Resident Evil 7. So if you guys haven't played it, I suggest uh, you guys go do now. But if you have, let's review it. Let's remember Resident Evil 7. That way we get our brains ready for this upcoming, for this game. All right, I'm gonna stay quiet for a bit. Let's watch it. <sighs> okay, where to start? My name, it's Ethan, Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. The people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. All right, I hope that gave you a little review, or summary, actually. So now let's get to the real deal. We're gonna go, we're gonna go casual, because personally, if I try standard and I die a lot, you're gonna hear me rage quit. <laughs> so we don't want that. And this, I am not ready for it. So, we're gonna start with the easiest difficulty, only because I need to get a feel for this, because I don't start playing those harder difficulties until I know what to do. All right, so bear with me here, okay? Man, oh man, I just need a, and I'm just like so excited for this game. I'm so excited, I really, I just really want to see what's going on. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. 
Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides... Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. Oh. I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. Alright, so this is his house. Okay. I will say this. Right off the bat. You already know something's wrong with her. Like, bro, like, just listen to her. Oh, sorry, Rose. There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Yeah, so basically what I was saying is, uh... Like, dude, just... Just right off the bat. Right off the... Okay, that's the shower. Right off the bat... You know something's up. Almost there, Like, honey. that's not... Sorry. Like, something's up, man. Like, I don't... I don't feel comfortable with her. Alright, let's put her down. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Alright, so let's do a little exploring. <laughs> well, like I said, just the way Mia is acting, right off the bat, that's not her. Something's up. <laughs> Alright, nice. Look at Mia. Dang, going through everything, huh? From the pregnancy to, like, every... To now. I wish it could stay Man. like this forever. Yeah, you know, Ethan, you gotta, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to move on from that once it gets 
get to that point. It's not paranoia if they're really out to get you. Oh, wait. Joseph Kendo. Man, rest in peace. Oh, he could have made it. So he's been getting some firearms training, which is good. That was creepy. Hello, what's this? Rosemary. Winters. The BSA, huh? Rose is fine. No, she's not. Alright, I'm just gonna skim through it. Oh man, that's that's insane. So yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot going on. I think the movement's a little slow. <coughs> Got to do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. You're gonna have to. George Trevor. Damn, Spencer Spencer did that family wrong. Like he did them really wrong. No no no, we're not gonna invert it. We're gonna kinda like move the No. Camera speed. Alright. Yeah, cause I'm used to like having it be a little fast, but not too fast. Hmm, interesting. Everyone's forgotten about this already. No, I really covered it up. Why do I even keep this around? I should get rid of it someday. Or you can break it. That's what I would have done. What's this? Alright, no copyright. Oh, I wanted to see his face. Get ourselves a nice shower. Hey! Keep it down. Just making sure it's locked. Damn, Mia. Or should I say No. Actually no, I'm not gonna say the name. That food does look good. But we Mom got you another new book? Already. And it took forever. <laughs> Alright. Enough let's just talk to Mia. Or I don't think that's her. Mia makes everything by hand, so this stuff keeps piling up. For real. Is she okay? Sleeping like uh well like a baby. Hmm, <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de la gum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Hmm. Local wine too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, 
Maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <sighs> Mia, get down! Mia! God. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! What? Why? Go move! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I've got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next day before o'clock? No problem. No problem. We'll, be we'll be there. That was the, that doc. Was the doc. She'll see us see next week. week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Oh man, they, that was so unexpected. But there's a re I know Chris did this for a reason. You can tell he was not proud of what he was doing. Jesus. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not authorized to walk over. Fuck. What the hell happened here? Already, things are going bad. So you fell off a hill or something. What happened to the member? Oh, this 
guy didn't make it. Eliminate target, recover body. Huh, that's interesting. What target? Do we got any weapons? Anything. How the heck did they get attacked though? Oh shoot, let's say he has claws. He's gonna wander off. We're gonna figure out what's going on. What's that noise? Where do I go? It's so dark. Guess I gotta keep walking. What is that? Alright, looks like I got a crawl on there. Oh, be careful, be careful. Oh man, I felt that. <laughs> I felt that. I swear, what is that noise? Something's following me. I don't have any firearms, nothing. What? Oh man, look at this. Oh my. Oh no. No, no, no. <laughs> Bunch of dead birds. <laughs> you know something bad's happening. <laughs> something's following me. a bridge. I swear I can't see anything ahead of him. Okay, we'll find a cabin. Wait, I think somebody's in there. Is there something? Nothing good. Damn, I need a firearm or something. What's that? Random person's clothes. I don't see a firearm. You know, at this point, anything will be useful. happened in here. <sighs> Yo, I'm kind of freaking out right now. I'm just staying calm. What's this? Oh, is that Mother Miranda? Oh. oh! I don't have a gun. Looking everywhere to get something. There's blood. Just a dead rat. What the heck? I literally just jumped right now. That scared the out of me, dude. Okay, this is where I'm at. Bro, I swear, I just jumped right now. That scared me. Go back upstairs or... 
Dude, there's something going on. Did all this. I would rather not find out. Okay, daylight. I could get myself out of here. Parkour. Okay, Ethan runs faster now. What is this place? Where the hell am I? Dude. What the heck? Look at this village. Bro, I don't know why I get RE4 vibes now. Saw that? Oh, shh, we saw that. Is there all the hold up before? Can I go through there or no? Yeah, no, no guns, nothing. Gotta keep exploring, I guess. What oh, happened? I would like to find out myself. Oh my god. I, I want to explore everywhere, but I don't know. I don't know what to check first. So that leads me to another area. Might as well like, might as well go see what's going on. Nothing. What's that symbol? Who really knows? Do not enter. Why not? Oh, well, I can't get in. No way through over there. Okay, so this is gonna be interesting. I'm already kind of freaking out. I mean, if I was the smartest person, I would have gone out. But then again, I have no resources, anything to to help me out in the long run. So it's just like, what's this? What do you missing the owner? And then this is locked. Alright, 
No, we gotta answer here. Oh, I got a knife. The heck is that? Okay, now I got a knife. I got a knife. Oh, there we go. Crafting materials, nice. Family photo. Alright. Did they just have. run out of the house? I think they did. You know, something bad has happened. Someone's in there. Someone's in there. Call on it. Ah, no, no. Friendly. Friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road and... What's going on? Oh no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? Do you have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Take it! Take it! Help me, it's out there. Hey, are you listening? Hey! What the? more oh man that old man didn't make it yeah I'm gonna kind of organize this is this is a lot like re4 Oh, there you go. Cool. Let me examine this. Alright. So that's all he was able to spare. Oh, man. What happened? Jesus Christ. What the hell is wrong with this place? Stay the back, bro. Stay back, you son of a. Take this. Ah, you like that, huh? What the hell? Damn, Ethan lost his damn hand fingers, and he just got that hand fixed. Dude. 
My health isn't. Oh, I got key items. I don't know if that family photo is a key item, but they will take it. Oh, that creature's gone. Oh, yes. I saw in the demo Ethan had his full hand. Here he doesn't have it at all. Screw that. Yeah, I would have started shooting that damn werewolf. No hesitation. Can't for it. I need herbs. It's gotta be an herb. Oh, there's an herb. There we go. Nice. Alright, so where do I go now? It's crazy, Ethan lost a full hand. Oh, you just can't catch a breed. Oh, I'm ready. Just exploring a little bit because I need to find some more ammo. Guess there's nothing here though. Yeah, there's nothing here. Curious mind. What is that? Oh, it's a radio. Oh, nothing. Oh, I got more ammo. Damn break on me. Oh my god! Yeah, get yourself in here. Come through you. Dare you come through there. Is it over? Shoot, maybe. Something on the way here. Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my... to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? Louisa's house. Hand. 
Oh, I'm too scared to freaking move. I don't have a shotgun. I shot that thing in the head, though, <laughs> luckily. I don't think I have enough bullets. Oh. Okay, well I got one. I got some force, buddy. Son of a. Yeah, you're freaking dead. Oh, you want one, huh? There's no way to them. Come on and screw this. Ooh. Okay. Thank you. I'm ready. Yeah, I like the old days. Not enough. I gotta just run this. There's no end to them. Okay, I got. I just gotta get over here. Oh yeah, no, 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 no. no. Damn it! Damn it! Get off me! Oh, screw this! Ah! I gotta go!
Did I survive that though? Straight up, like, I should have been dead. Dude, I wasn't even guarding a lot, so that was my mistake. Why I took a lot of damage. There's no way in heck we're surviving that. Doesn't need though. In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? you the child's father child hey wait do you mean rose is she here <laughs> rose rose yes she is in great danger since mother miranda brought her to the village we have fallen into darkness what are you talking about the monsters castle <sighs> bell heralds danger they're coming <laughs> no Wait, where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again. <laughs> Rose is here? You know, damn well she's insane. Okay, hopefully this is just like somewhere in the... Damn well. well, at least this time we can explore. Sorry, we couldn't explore at all. I want to use the knife more often, but I know if I keep getting attacked by the lichens, I'm gonna get badly damaged. Nothing. Easy pick to lock. I don't even have a lock pick. The heck is a ceremony? Can't fluid. 
I do have enough health. But I'm not sure though if it's um needed at the moment. Like uh, those lichens. Cause that's what they're called. Alright. So this is where we gotta get to. But again, what do we need? So far, Ethan runs faster in this game than the RE7. He ran so slow. I wouldn't even consider it running. Castle Dummy Chest. That's how it's pronounced in the game, but in real life, I do not know. No. Yeah, nice. I got an achievement. Can't even get into it. Don't we trust? More herbs. Guess this leads to the castle. Yeah, but I feel like we're gonna get captured before we even get to dummy dress. Bunch of weird symbols. So this village is already creeping me out. I do have the shotgun, so leave hands. And look, here they are, Mother Miranda. Eisenberg, don't know who that is. Dummy Trust, and I still don't know who that is. Oh, a typewriter! Alright, we're gonna save up in a bit. And I'm gonna call it in. But let's just go. Let's just go and install it. I'm just saying, dude, that was insane. Oh, uh, the crest won't fit here? This one. This looks like a bird. Wait. Wait. I'm not doing it right. Wait. There we go. Got the first piece, now I need the other piece. Alright, so this is where here we are. There we go. So yeah, I'm gonna stop right here. Hope you enjoyed that. My god, I got scared <laughs> so bad. Oh man, this game's gonna be so hard. I know that for sure, that's why I'm playing casual. But yeah, be ri be sure to look out for some more parts because I will be covering this whole game. And uh, see you guys next time. I cheer out.